I'm also here to give you a broader perspective on sort of other risks that um, the international community, the financial community, the insurance community is not necessarily uh, equipped to help us manage those risks. We notice that the financial community and the insurance community is not equipped to help us manage the long-term, medium and long-term risks of climate on those projects that are supposed to mitigate climate change. For example, uh, solar projects, CSP projects, or wind farms when you have uh, your weather totally changing. And today, developers will tell you, I don't want to take the risk over because the way we have structured those projects in long-term power purchasing agreements, 15 years minimum, 20 years, the de developers tell you today, well, I'm not even sure I, I, I can guarantee the performance of my plants between now and 10 years, 15 years, 20 years. So the, the way we are now, we are being asked to structure those projects, again, celerity and orderly transition is changing. And we, are, uh, we need to take control of that change. So without being able to predict uh, how climate is going to evolve, we need to very quickly be able to structure those projects so that we provide those solutions, at least for the medication part of the business. Adaptation is a totally different story.